hello and welcome so today we're going to create the Instagram story so in the design section here I have the video container basically the container of the video that match the screen size which in this case I'm using Samsung Galaxy S8 and then I also have captions which are located down below the sections and the navigation which including the likes buttons and stuff and also the amounts of the new likes that I will be code later on so when we tap the likes button the number will be added automatically and the status message of our own status on the uh, story which is an improvement of the Instagram feature and of course we have the rectangle which is the parent from each of the object here which is um, here in this case it's located on the header headers and then frame 2 basically located on the footer in this case okay so let's go into the code section first we're going to create the uh, video progress running bar within the uh, progress.animate which is the uh, animation and in this case I'm using this property values as you can see the uh, progress bar moves perfectly and then secondly I'm going to uh, try to uh, create the uh, caption section so when I tap the uh, info button um, later you will see then the status or the captions will appear um, down below in the story while the story also uh, running at the same time so you can see the status and the story at the same time basically so I define three objects here which is the caption status message info and its property values and then also navigations all of these are states with uh, several names like ascent and uh, descent and stuff so um, later I can switch uh, the name of the states uh, based on what I want the animation and the code workflow to work so here when the info is on click which is an event then I'm just going to add the name of each states here which is uh, calling the uh, states by the name like um, captions animate ascend and stuff so something like that and then also for the status message on click which I will return to default so it will return to default states um, I don't need to define the default states but it will automatically define the states of the default positions and opacity and stuff before you you know adding some animations or uh, customizations so now we're going to add the video of course you go with video new video layer here in this case i'm using the image um, cat.mov which is the format and in this case please put your videos into the folder of images on your projects folder and then please rename your video with a easy to recognize uh, name in this case i'm using my own video with this cat.mov it's showing two of my kittens here as you can see on the video later so here we're going to play the video like using video parent or the video container and then center back which is the layer itself back on, uh, on the back of the uh, of the name of my username Cordova and stuff there and yeah it works so now I'm going to delete uh, the video verse so let's just uh, work on the like button in this case I'm using the like states and adding the uh, state name which is small or like and the property values as simple as that and um, yeah and also adding like amount states that height height is basically the name so when I tap the uh, like button then the new amount of number will be shown upon the uh, default amount so something like that so each layer replacing each others here and I'm switching the default to small the like and when like on click here which is the event and I'm using the if logics here and the nested if logics as you can see in the previous projects um, we've already talked about that we've already done some projects before and here I'm going to uh, utilize the calling the uh, states and the animation as its uh, as its property values like default height and stuff. And um, of course I'm also adding the else command or logic here. Um, so if I didn't click or if I click, what happens in this case? Um, this is the code. As you can see, you can pause the video and uh, write time or yeah learn the code. And now we're going to add the video again. So there you go, the video plays, and when I tap the info button, the status appear, and when I hit like, then I it 
it changed the uh, number of likes so yep it's cool it's working okay so thank you so much for watching subscribe to support this channel have a great day